Good morning. Good morning. I honestly feel as bad as I look right now. I really do. It's just what I look like all morning. I came on my period this morning. <laughs> when I tell you I haven't had a period that feels like this in forever, I really mean it. My stomach. I'm usually the girl that gets backache in my stomach. It feels like someone's playing took a war with it. Hoppy hoppy the hot water bottle. She's giving me some comfort. Oh. I had to drag myself to get in the shower to wash my hair. I wanted to sit and get ready because I'm going to my boyfriend today and I just wanted to feel a little bit better. I thought if I get ready and wash my hair and put some makeup on I might feel a little bit better but Jesus Christ. But hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to a brand new video. I'm actually gonna get ready with you this morning thought you could get ready with me deal with this whole process with me because i just don't want to be on my own whilst going through this because i'm in pain i'm in a lot of pain right now it's kind of a problem my boyfriend did bring me around these last night he was like you period snacks you period snacks i've got one left i've got one left i sat in at the mall last night he brushed my teeth and got ready for bed and i sat in at all them this rate i just want to go back to bed but we're actually gonna make ourselves feel better. We're gonna make ourselves feel better. And we're just gonna, we're just gonna try our best. We can take it slow, but we're gonna try our best. I could do with hurrying up and getting ready. I woke up and I had come on my period and I was looking everywhere for some tampons. I've got two. And I don't think these are gonna last me till I'm ready that do you know them days when you're on your period and you're just like, this can't be normal. This cannot be normal. That's how I feel. Maybe doing a little bit of skincare might help. I've been using this recently. I got I picked this up like two weeks ago, so I've been using it for about two weeks now. It's the Inculus Hyaluronic Acid Serum. I actually really like this. My skin, my skin feels better, I can tell you that. My skin really does feel better for me. I don't feel good at all. I'm just going to be very honest, this is what it feels like when I come on a period. I, I'm just going to try and smile through this pain. I don't know how. I don't know how I didn't understand that I was coming on my period because... Monday night I started crying over this boy on TikTok who was feeling really sad and he was like, I don't know, why hasn't anyone noticed that? I started sobbing over it and then I started sobbing over this um, woman had two dogs and the small one was blind and the big dog helped the blind dogs get down the stairs. And I was sobbing at that. And I've, I did wonder why my boobs looked two sizes bigger all week and every time I looked in the mirror I felt fat. I did, why? Why didn't I even catch on? Why didn't I even catch on? Anyway, I'm gonna go cover my body in this. I'm gonna go cover my body in this, and then at least I smell good. Like, if I don't get any further than this, at least I smell good, and at least I tried. I'm gonna see how it goes. I'm hoping to be able to put a bit of makeup on. I really don't feel that good about myself. I need to dry this hair as well. Got myself dressed. I got myself dressed. I used to love these as a kid. I've honestly got the best boyfriend. I think I'm gonna get myself ready. Um, I'm gonna go get a hot chocolate and go to B&M. B&M always cheers me up. B&M always cheers me up. I'm gonna go dry my hair and I'll probably just straighten it and I feel like this part will be a bit boring for you so I'll come back when I try. To put some makeup on my hair's done i feel a little bit better I feel a little bit better i've not felt like that on my period for the longest time that i completely forgot how it it all felt 
I'm a hormonal cow when I'm on my period, like a hormonal cow. They, I just get frustrated and angry, it's silly little things. She's my little lifesaver, she's my little lifesaver. My boyfriend bought me this for, Chris for Christmas and it's my favourite present anyone's ever bought me. Like, she's the cutest little thing in the world. Some makeup on, go and do something fun. I always find walking helps me, it takes me ages to get myself up to go on go on a walk but walking to my boyfriend's and nipping to be in um and get a hot chocolate should work and i feel like i'll feel so much better after i just get up and do it i'm also really excited to go and see my boyfriend's dogs because my boyfriend's dogs are the kind kindest dog like my dog won't cuddle me for ages he just wants to be stroked but like them dogs will literally sit on you and cuddle you he's got two He's got two bulldogs. I think they've been in a few videos before. One of them's a one year, year old. The other one's two. And the one year old is the craziest dog I've ever met. Look how cute my dog looked last night. My dog slept on my bed last night and that's how he liked to go to sleep. It's just the cutest thing. And also here he is again on my boyfriend's lap wrapped in his work jacket. This one's Dave. We bought him this giant new toy from pets at home like it was massive and we thought because it's got rope they'll play together with it that is the same day he's the craziest dog you'll ever meet but he's so he's so kind i've just finished filming the whole of this video and i thought i'd add add this section of the video in here because these things make me happy and i just wanted something happy and cheerful in included in this video so i'm actually bringing you uh an autumn sheen staple little haul i picked up loads of bits for the autumn and i'm so excited that it's finally autumn this is my favorite time of the year it makes me so happy makes me so cheerful so i just wanted something like this to be included in this video i do just want to quickly say this section of the video is kindly sponsored by sheen so thank you so much to sheen for sponsoring this little section of the video let's get started i have actually got one of these items on i picked up this jumper but i couldn't help not wear it today because this is so soft it's this knitted little jumper these are my favorite things to wear through the autumn they're so comfy they're literally just the softest thing i always go for like sweater jumpers through the autumn i feel like they're really girly and really they're just really nice they're just really nice and girly and easy to throw on when it gets cold i did size up and get a medium in this so like the arms are very big but these are the kind of i want things to be oversized in the autumn but let me just sit like this so you can see it a little bit better. It's not too long, but it's it's a nice length. It's not too long, not too short. I really like it. My dog's come to join us. He's also excited about all these warm, cosy clothes for the autumn because he loves to sit on them. He loves to sit on them. Like I said, these are like my staple things to wear through the autumn winter. Next up, I have this jacket. I feel like you're all going to really like this. When I first seen this, I thought, oh... On the picture it looked a little bit more khaki and I thought, oh, Zara dupe, the Zara leather jacket dupe, but this is almost, this is actually grey, this is so nice, I wear this all the time, it's just a faux leather biker jacket which is in this like ashy grey wash colour and this I'm obsessed with, again I picked this up in a medium, I always pick my jackets up in a medium so they're big and oversized, I love this jacket, I love, I love faux leather biker jackets i just feel like especially this time of year they just they just work they're just so nice to throw on especially with like an outfit like this this would go really nice with love this jacket this is such good quality and it also isn't that horrible fishy smell do you know that fake leather fish smell i can't do that i hate that smell and i was so glad that this didn't come smelling like that because i can't stand that smell i also picked up another jacket we've got two more jackets after this one but this is a long black trench coat. This is going to be really hard to, for me to show you. But it's a long black trench coat. I absolutely love this. I, this is from the Daisy Select 
daisy section of Sheen's website. I had this already in a beige colour and I wore that endlessly last autumn and I feel like that's a staple coat. So I also wanted a black one because I just know I'm going to get so much wear out of this. I love a trench through the autumn winter. I just feel like they're just so nice. They just, they, they make me feel really expensive. They make me feel really expensive. So I picked up this black long trench coat again such good quality i also picked this up in a medium i love this i will add some try on clips so you can try on clips with the coat so you can see them better on because that it wasn't doing it justice we've got enough dupe we've got enough dupe i can't bring myself to pay that much money on augs that i thought i'd try out these i picked up loads of snow boots from sheen last year but none of them did it none of them was like the perfect of dupe i think these maybe are i'm not sure if ugg do do like this bit they kind of look like slippers but they're a chunky snow boot and i loved this tan brown color i don't think these are going to last year as long as uggs were last year but the quality of them are good that they'll probably get you all the way through autumn which for how cheap these are compared to the uggs like i'd rather break and only have to replace 20 15 pound rather than 100 like that's a big jump isn't it but these are so soft like look at all that teddy thermal fur this is all the way inside these are the comfiest softest shoes i've ever put on in my life these are going to be my complete autumn winter shoe because these these are like walking on snow walking on clouds if you want a good old dupe if you want a good old dupe she Sheen's your gal. Sheen's your gal. Of course, if it's the autumn winter, I am going to pick up the tracksuit. You know me. You know me by now. You know that's just how I work. I live in tracksuits all year round, to be honest. I picked up a grey... A grey basic tracksuit. I like to pick up my tracksuits oversized in the autumn winter because i want something really chunky to throw on because i get so cold cuffed waistband and also a cuffed leg gray jogger thermal inside because you know what i'm like i can't do tracksuits that aren't thermal but i really liked the jumper of this i thought the jumper was really nice it's just a quarter zip it's just a quarter zip gray little grey little jumper but this would be a really nice staple tracksuit to have in your wardrobe through autumn another jacket i did actually pick up was this green this green little jacket again I, i've seen so many people get jackets like this off of zara and zara jacket prices are through the freaking roof like i'm sorry but this is just a khaki green little it's almost denim it's al almost like a thin denim little jacket this is going to be so much easier if i just show you this show you this on in the try on clip but this is such a nice jacket i did wasn't sure if i was going to like the way this fit but it does actually fit really nice and oversized and it's got loads of pockets on it and i just thought for little dog walks almost like a bomber jacket but it's not puffy if that makes any sense to you this with a leggings lounge set for a dog walk i thought would look really nice throw on a scarf over the top i really liked the idea of that outfit we've also got a pair of pajamas we've also got a pair of pajamas these are fluffy pajamas and i'm not a fluffy pajama kind of gal but these are the softest thing in the world when i seen these and i was like i was just like these are like a girly barbie pink dream and i love these are a straight leg pajama bottom they are almost ribbed they're like the rib detailing on them these are like sleeping in a marshmallow this is like sleeping in a marshmallow and i'm so here for it so freaking here for it they're just pink just baby pink i love them this is inside out and here's the matching little pajama top it's just like a little sweat sweat jumper kind of just like a little sweat sweater kind of design and then it just says lucky day on in black i love the color of this i thought this is just the cutest pajama set in the world and the last thing i did actually pick up i'm going to put this on now just to show you the show you this on because this is my favorite this is this is my favorite coat jacket coat jacket i've ever seen it's almost like an aviator style coat but it's not actually leather this is so nice it's just this brown 
brown little jacket. It's got teddy fur all in it, all over the collars. I'm sorry. Is this not your... Is this not beautiful? Is this not the most beautiful coat you've ever seen in the world? This with them... With them up dupes. But that is everything I actually did pick up from Sheen this time around. Sheen's autumn section, if you don't know, get to know because there is so much on there right now. I need it all. I need it all. Again, I will put the discount on sc screen here for you so you can go save 15%. And thank you again to Sheen for sponsoring this section of the video. And, I and let's get back into the video. I tried this for the first time yesterday. It's the... Beauty Crop Vitamin B Vitamin Enriched Glow Prime, Primer and it also has SPF 45 in. I had to pick up a new glow mist and I've seen so many people talk about this and I tried it out yesterday and this makes my skin look so good. It's kind of a joke how good this makes my skin look. I'll put some on and show you. Yeah. I also really like the fact this has got SPF serum because I put SPF on it every single morning. I use the Bondi Sans one, that's just part of my skincare routine. But having a primer with it in as well, I just feel like my skin is like extra protected. Where really. this way, I believe I'm not gonna wrinkle. Like, can you see that? Look how good my look how good my skin looks. Skin with my skincare routine at the minute is completely giving glazed donut and I'm so here for it. I want this makeup to stay on all day today, so I'm also gonna go in with the We Shari gripping primer as well. Just because I know this makes my skin so tacky that my makeup really does not come off. When I first tried this primer, I was like, I don't believe what everyone's saying about this makes your skin so tacky. That it things stick to it, but I never really know that you have to leave it to set for a few minutes, and then it literally makes like I could stick the bottle to my face. I need to fill my water bottle up, but I really see BA. I think my skin is also thriving at the minute because I drink. This is six hundred and fifty ml, so I drink about six of these a day. So over three litres of water a day and my skin's really thriving, even my body's thriving. But I've been using the this new, I've uploaded my everything shower routine. I uploaded a video of that the other day and I included the shower gel I use. Bayless and Hardin, the vitamin C and niacinamide body wash and it's so good. And then I've been moisturising either with this which is the Garnier vitamin C the body superfood or I use the cocoa butter one and then at my boyfriend's I have the aloe vera one the aloe vera one is one of my favorites but they're the three that I really like this one is mango and it's vitamin C as well and it's really my all of my body just seems like alive like it doesn't seem dull anymore just taking my Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Fill. I'm going to do my everyday makeup. Sorry if this video has been a little bit of a down one. But I just wanted to keep it really real. And this is how I felt. Like I really wanted to film a get ready with me. Like a morning vlog this morning. And this is just how I am today. I've woke up and I'm on my period. And the first day is just sometimes really hard. And I didn't want to just come on here and fake being happy fake feeling okay like hide my water bottle hide missy's little floppy i just wanted to keep it really real i hope one of you really relates to this but just take this video as a little sign that it's okay to have a day where you have to have a slower morning and just be in your feelings sit with your hot water bottle and feel rubbish and it's okay to eat a full pack of squares bars full pack of chocolate it's just all okay i've just finished my makeup i actually really like it today i actually feel like i've got all the hairs all over my face Ew. i actually feel like i look really pretty which i'm glad because i just feel like they're all just gonna shut down on me so at least i feel pretty i'm just gonna put some argan oil in the ends of my hair 
to make them look all nice and shiny. I'm actually really proud I even finished getting ready this morning. I honestly thought that I'd stop halfway through. I never, I didn't think I was gonna get to the point where my makeup's done. I'm gonna actually leave this video here because I'm gonna go pack a bag and also run to the shop and get some tampons. I'm going to the shop and get some tampons. Pack a bag. And I'm gonna go B and M home bargains the range. I'm gonna have a nice girly day. And then go to my boyfriend's. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you all in my next video. Bye!